What's going on, all you Raiders, Doomers, Crusaders, and Scullies out there? Uh, it's me, Russell, here with Rusty Bullwhips back again for another awesome video. So, I'm in a pretty good mood today because, well, for one, Coast 103.5 started their Christmas music marathon. So, I'm pretty happy about that. Um, I just got a package in the mail today. My second reason for being really happy today and really excited from Isaac of Elias and Wood Company. It's in this box right here. And for context, uh, earlier this week I sent Isaac my Adventurer Bull Whip. You remember that whip it is the one that I bought at the first California Jones event. I had sent it to him to have the handle shortened and he happily did so. And I also sent him some falls to wax and he also did that as well. So we're gonna be unboxing the whip and I'm just gonna stop rambling on here. So. Let's get right into the unboxing. Here's the box, and we're gonna open it right now. So this is the same box that I sent the whip to Isaac in. Uh, we're just gonna snip the tape here. Hopefully I don't uh, cut myself and die or something. <laughs> here we go, I'm really excited. There's the whip. There we go. This is already looking much better. All right, folks, here it is. The new and improved Adventure Bull Whip. Um, if you guys remember, the handle actually appeared to be longer at about 10 inches, but Isaac had told me that it was eight inches from the transition zone to the bottom. But I had requested for him to just shorten the handle just slightly to give it more of that Indiana Jones aesthetic and he has delivered very well. He tied on a brand new heel knot. It's very nicely braided and we have a new wrist loop on. He did an excellent job and he was updating me constantly on the progress of the whip and he does really good at customer service. So he just went ahead and rewaxed the whip. Uh, this is the same, basically, all the stuff on here is the same as when I sent it out. Uh, even the cracker, he actually waxed the cracker in, so I don't know if that's going to affect the sound or the weight or anything like that. But, but overall, this looks much better, and I feel I'll be able to handle this more. I'm going to take it outside and give it a few test cracks later on, but I am very impressed. So Isaac, when you see this video, Thank you very much, dude. You are just an amazing guy. Thanks so much for fixing up this whip. And not only did he fix up my whip, but he also sent, he also waxed my falls. So I sent him a bunch of my white paracord falls and they're actually looking much better now. Now that they're waxed, they're a little stiff, but they're going to be a lot heavier. So when I attach them onto my whips, my whips are gonna be able to crack with a, a lot better. They're gonna be waterproof and it's just all gonna be, it's gonna be good. So, yeah. Anyways, I'm very happy with this. Uh, if you guys need a whip to be fixed or if you wanna order a whip, be sure to go to Isaac Eliason, have a license whip company. I'll put a link to his Etsy shop in my description. And thanks for watching this video, guys.